Yo, what is going on YouTube? My name is Jaden and today we're going to be playing some Clash of Clans again. So uh, this is going to be the fifth episode of the Fresh Start series that we created. And um, yeah, in the last episode that I made, uh, we were able to upgrade my uh, Town Hall to level 3 and upgrade a couple of my... Uh, uh, or actually get a couple of my defenses and buildings and stuff like that. Now, uh, it looks like we have an achievement, Unbreakable. Alright, so we successfully attacked against, or <laughs> we successfully defended against, uh, 10, I think it was? 10 attacks, but which is awesome. Uh, so we got, I think, 5 or 10, I forget. Uh, I think it was 5. But anyway, we are going to be able to get this clan castle right now. We have 16,000. So yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> I mean, oh, wait, hold on. Let's see what we get here. Alright, so we got a thousand of uh, each um, uh, golden elixir. But anyway, uh, let's, let's unlock it. Awesome. So, also, we have just completed a uh, quest achievement. Alright, uh, so we have gotten the clan castle. And right now, we're actually going to be going to my clan. Um, yeah, uh, as soon as I can actually work this thing. Alright, so we're gonna have to use our clan code because I don't know why, but my clan won't just won't show up. So, uh... Oh! Oh! Okay! I guess that doesn't work. Um... Did I miss anything? What? Yeah, RPG29... YJ29... Oh, uh, wait. I'm, I'm... I'm confused. God dang it. <laughs> yeah, I found it, but, uh... I'm gonna have to lower the trophies to zero now. Alright, so I'm just gonna save that real quick. And I'm just gonna join that real quick. I'd like to join the clan. And I am in. Oh, I'm in. <laughs> so uh yeah, which is gonna be awesome. And uh how many can I hold? How much can I hold from the clan dancer? I can hold ten. And uh yeah, uh so we're, we're gonna be able to donate some troops to myself. We're gonna be able to donate ten. So now that we have the clan castle, I'm going to make a quick base, uh, just putting my clan castle kind of like in the middle. Uh, so I will be right back. So at this point in time, I really don't care if my resources get attacked because, I mean, really, I'm not going to lose that much. So yeah, that's why I'm just leaving them out in the open. So I'm just probably going to protect them a little bit just by a couple cannons and stuff like that. That was a mistake. Uh, I guess just by one cannon. And just put the buildings, I guess, around it. Uh, it's going to get tacked either way, so it really doesn't even matter. And I'm not going to get that much taken out of me, so... And this is not like, even like a base online or anything, it's just like... I, I, I don't even think you need to make a base from- or take a base from online near a town hall tree, like me. Just, just you know, slap down your army camps there, and like, you know, later up there. These rocks are so annoying. And they take 20,000 just to get rid of them. Oh. Alright, this is my uh, base that just like, popped into my mind real quick. Uh, it's not that bad, but you know, it's not really the best. But uh, who really cares right now for Town Hall 3? But uh, yeah, I guess we're going to be maxing out the Town Hall 3 because that's the best we can do. Um, we're going to go and attack as soon as I make some troops because I forgot to make some troops before I recorded. But we don't have anything special, so I guess we'll go with like a couple of these and a couple giants and... We just want to... Okay, so just... Just that. Alright. Alright, so we just finished our troops, and we're gonna go with attack. Let's see how uh, the single player is looking. It might be a little... Oh! Oh, um... That actually looks kinda hard. Uh... Because most likely there's gonna be bonds here. Um, well, actually, let's try it out. We might be able to get it. So, you know what? We're just gonna check it. Alright, I thought there was gonna be a bomb there. So we'll just put four of these here. Uh, not you there, not you there, not you there, and not you there. And they can't reach that. Okay, so uh, we're gonna have to place a couple of barbarians here too. And most likely there's gonna be a bombs here too, so I gotta watch out for them. 
So these giants are tank are tanking it, and they're. Ugh, I don't know if they're gonna be able to take that down that uh, cannon. So I guess we didn't really have a use for these uh, wall breakers, but uh, it might be a three star. Hopefully, I mean that other giant just got taken down, and we only have a couple troops left. Uh, yeah. Yep, that was a fail. Okay. So it seems like I am too low to attack that right now. So we're just going to train up some troops. I got scared. My computer just shut off. But um, we're just going to train up some troops and try and attack someone from uh, multiplayer. And then I'll probably wrap up this video. Uh, not really a long one because there's really not that much to do when you're only in Town Hall 3. But uh, yeah. Let's make like three of them. Maybe four of them. And just make a couple of higher headwall breakers and just make a couple of these. Alright guys, we have just finished up the troops and uh, yeah, we're going to attack some multiplayer. Oh, uh, but first before we begin, uh, the reason why I'm not playing any Call of Duty at this moment is because I'm kind of a little bit grumpy for my Xbox. But yeah, it's just between you and me. So anyway, let's get right into this attack. So, uh, oh, that's actually quite a bit of loot. And they don't really have that many defenses, so I guess we can put... Um, let's put a giant, uh, alright, hold on, let's see. It doesn't even have any walls, so, <laughs> no use for the wall breakers again. So, uh, I guess we'll place three right here. Uh, a couple of barbarians and a couple archers, so they can take down these defenses. And just a barbar, uh, <laughs> a barbarian, a giant right there, and a couple barbarians and a couple archers. Uh, maybe just a couple archers. And, make sure there's no other defenses. Good. Alright, so, uh, see how much damage these do. Wow, that is not a lot at all. <laughs> I guess. Wow, that is disappointing. Wall breakers, the things with bombs can't do a lot of damage at all. Like little skeletons with bombs that explode don't do a lot of damage at all, actually. Like, I think that was like a millimeter, not even a millimeter. But anyway, we were able to take down those defenses. Those were really easy. There's only three defenses and not even any walls, so uh, I guess it was just slight work. And uh, we're able to take down that town hall and a couple of the resources as well. That archer is just... Alright, so a couple archers are going to be taking out this clan castle. Maybe everything else with it too. Is there anything else over here in the corners? No, okay. So that is the rest of the base. Awesome. Three star. And are we even in a leak? No, we are not. I think it's 400. Yeah, 400. So, um... We might be able to attack one more time, so I'll see you guys when I have all my- Whoa, that's way too much. Well, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys when my troops are trained. Alright, so we have just trained all of our troops, and yeah, let's uh, go find a, a base on multiplayer. Oh wow, that is terrible. Wow, looks like these bases without walls are just really good for food. I mean, not a lot of gold, but quite a bit of elixir. We're just gonna attack it real quick. There's only an archer tower. Okay, so the cannons are out here and the archer tower is inside. Which is easy. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we're gonna place a giant right here, a giant right here, and a couple of uh, archers and barbarians here too. And just the last two uh, giants right here, and a couple of barbarians and archers. And, you know, just uh, spam down some. Oh, yeah, I forgot they go through the thing. And once again, no use for the wall breaker, so we'll just set it down right here. Oh, where are they going? Oh my god, that is. <laughs> Oh, wow. Alright. Well, um, yeah, I guess that was a three star. Those wall breakers did not help at all since they went over to the walls that made no sense. I didn't even know what he was trying to do there. Um, he has no other walls, does he? No. So, uh, yeah. I'm just gonna finish up this raid. Uh, I put in a couple go uh, goblins there to speed up the attack a little bit. I know they do double damage to town halls. Uh, resources and the clan castle uh, in the new update that they just did. So, oh, we also got an achievement, which is awesome, and we're just gonna finish up that last building. Awesome, that was a three star. We got 12,000 elixir and 2,000, oh, 3,000 gold. Oh, okay. I forgot about this. Oh my god, we got 10,000 of uh, gold and elixir, which is awesome. Wow. Uh, so I guess we'll do the two treasury. Okay. Uh, okay, so it goes in your clan castle. And um, I guess we'll have to uh, use up all of my golden elixir to actually restore it. And uh, we got five gems from that, which is pretty cool. 
Uh, and uh, yeah, let's um, upgrade something. Let's see what we'll be able to upgrade. Gold storage. Is gold storage useful at this time? Mm, yeah, I think so. But we can also upgrade another thing too. So we can upgrade. Not that. Oh wow, we can't even upgrade it until 4. Or until Tunnel 4. So what we're going to do is we're going to upgrade... Alright, so we're going to upgrade this gold storage right here. Even though this one's level 1, we're just going to upgrade this one since we have a bigger storage. And we're also going to upgrade uh, something with a lot of elixir too. So I'm guessing this. 10,000. I mean, that's the best we can do right now. Uh, so we just take that. And because I know your treasury can be taken out of your clan castle if you get attacked. But um, I'm just probably going to leave it in there for now. So thank you so much for watching. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.